Okay, how's it going guys? Connor just here and welcome back to some more Pokemon Postscriptum. Last time we uh, wasn't really much, you know, Pokemon stuff. It was mostly story related. We came here, you know, we were late for our job application so we fainted. Had thoughts of suicide I think, I don't know. Uh, and then these guys had a plan to use us as, I don't know what they're using us as honestly. A scapegoat? They had us put a letter in our shoe and then we're sh fucking sailing off to some other area. I don't know why, but uh, I guess we'll find out. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get right back into it. I think we did it, sir. We dodged, we dodged a bullet there. Oh, I'm sweating like a tepig. Let's hope he manages to get out of the building without being seen. Have they left? Well, in case they haven't, let's hope they will not catch him with the letter on him. That fool will surely drop it after a day or two, and when he does, he will be in another region. And even better, in another branch altogether. <laughs> Mwahaha! Evil laugh! Brilliant, Gorgi. That's why you are my right-hand man. I'm honored, sir. Oh yeah, that, that, that was definitely... Whatever was up there just fucking disappeared, so... I'm not sure if that person was eavesdropping, or... Most likely was eavesdropping. It wouldn't just make that disappear for nothing. Now let's be vigilant until he reaches the ship. I've got a great feeling about this one. I'm sure he pulled it off. Yes, after all, we found the perfect candidate. Ha ha ha. Mwahaha. Okay. Apparently in this game we are taking control of a freaking idiot. Oh man, I can't believe it. Such magnificent and kind-hearted people. They... they accepted me. Not even McDonald's would accept me, oh my god! <laughs> Jesus, what kind of a loser are we in this game? After all those years, did I finally make it? No. No time to think about these things right now. I need to leave immediately. Okay, before I leave, I'm going to talk to every single person here. What do you mean Grandma said no parcel? She always sends one every month, you useless clerk. Aw. You guys have been standing there for half an hour, are you kidding me? Well, I did what you told me. I'm picking up your parcel, I swear. No, I'm, I'm not with... What? Wait, how do you... No, I mean... No, I'm the freaking post office. It's the truth. I'm in the post office. It's the truth, hey. Beep. Unbelievable. What is happening? Get out of my way, you scrub. Oh my god, fight! How was your first, you moron? Yeah, in front of me, don't stop arguing. They're constantly screaming. Fills me with rage! Nerd rage! My bank rewarded me with a gift for being a faithful customer. I'm here to pick it up because they said that it would cost... cost me to send it directly to my house. I feel privileged. What comes next? Am I really going to talk to every single person here? I probably shouldn't. Uh, where do I go? Do I just leave this place? I guess we do. Okay. Off to the ship. Well, if it isn't the new recruit. Hold it there. Rumors of misconduct. A shady subordinate. A convenient recruit at the right time. This is not sufficient evidence, but... I know there is something going on here. And you can be a potential accomplish. So, accomplish? You mean accomplice? I'll have to frisk you. Oh no, please don't frisk my shoe. Is he gonna frisk my shoe? Huh, clear. Guess he didn't frisk my shoe. Know this though, the higher-ups will soon send more investigators who will monitor the activities of this branch. If you are honest, you've nothing to be afraid of. Let's hope you are. The fuck? That's German! Off Weidershin? I don't think I pronounced that right. Man, that was close. Why didn't I just give him the letter? Like, what the fuck does it have to do with me? Five days and a half later. Gah! Man, I'm so seasick. Ugh. Why'd I accept this job? Blurga! Oh. We arrived? We did? We finally did! This is it. Let's take a deep breath. Whew. Okay. I will make it this time. I will make it. I will survive. Finally, I'm here. I'm so freaking anxious I can't even I can't even move. But I need to keep going. 
Maybe this is my big chance. All right, let's go. Huh? Who the fuck are these people? Hello, sir. Please, sir. You just arrived from those rich lands. Please give us something. What the hell? Spare any change? Please, sir. Fuck you people. Come on, I have a family to feed. Go, go fucking get a job. Hello? <laughs> they just wait for people to get off the boat and ask for money? Why are you tourists always this cruel? You have no hearts, you monsters. Get a fucking job. How many of these pe people are fucking jobless? Please, sir, something. Just give us something, you. Uh, I'm sorry? I don't have anything on me. Liar. You all say the same thing. You just pass through as if you have no care in the world. Aren't we alive to you? Are we just pieces of garbage? Enough of this. This is the last ship for six months. We will starve till the next one comes. What the hell's going on here? What kind of what kind of place is this? Sorry, sir, but we gotta eat. We would pay back if we could. Really sorry. Frisk, 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 frisk. Uh, this is unfortunate. He's telling the truth, everyone. He has zero money. Zero. These people were gonna rob me. What the fuck? <laughs> Are there no police? Poor bloke's just another squatter. Dang. Hey, sorry about that. Uh, we would gladly welcome you, but there is nothing left in the city anymore. We were unable to feed ourselves, and why are you still here? What is going on in this place? I don't know what's a poor guy doing here, but you're welcome to try surviving like us, though. Well, he can't go back now anyway, so... Leave him be. I don't have much energy left for this. Hey, we're sorry. Please don't take this personally. This place, this place is no good. I don't know why you're here. You can try heading north if you feel brave enough, now that you'll not that you'll get anything out of it. Oh, and since you have arrived, you might want to see that Mortimer guy. He's been making money off tourists for many years. He and his little gang are leeching off our lives. But eventually, if you are thirsty, you will have to go there. That's how his money is made. That's how the city operates. Anyway, sorry for this mess. We have to go. Good luck to you. Courier. What the? How the heck do you know? Wait. What the hell's going on? Ah, must have seen my invitation when they frisked me. Whatever. This was quite the warm welcome. Can't blame them. I know that feeling. Either I get this job or I'll finally join them. Mother, I'm really sorry. Wait, join who? My mom dead? Hello, sailors. Get in line, will ya? Tell me what to do. Okay. Apparently I can't run yet. Just want to check out this place a bit. Hello, sailor. You, why don't you take a last take a shower? What? You mean like a bath or something? I don't know, three days ago or something? Huh, so three days it is. Ha, huh, I see. Scribble, scribble, scribble. Note, subject hasn't showered for three days. No correlation between being a snowflake and taking showers. Excuse me? What the heck? Subject looks like if he were the epitome of immaturity. What? Subject responds like a sensitive five-year-old. Prone to emotional outbursts and teen-like angst. What is happening? Okay, then how about I ignore you and leave? Subject resorts to shaming... Hold on. Shaming tactics and fake withdrawal, which is spelled wrong. Probably... Fuck, I had to move my mic. There we go. Probably an avoidant personality. What is acceptable to you, then? Am I even allowed to speak? Subject self-identifies as a philosopher... Delusions are a primary sign of... Gah, shut the fuck up. Wow, so defensive. Chill out, man. I'm doing this for science, you know? Being hostile and rude is not a socially acceptable behavior, you know? Yeah, how about you, Mr. Sailor Scientist? Sorry, I'm sorry, but I cannot converse with irrational people like you. Please go away. Can't believe this. What the fuck was that conversation? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well... Talk to this guy then. What kind of name is Artes Artesmius? Fuck, I just don't know how to pronounce that. 
Artemisia City. Fuck. Sounds like ancient tongue or what have you. Does it even mean something? Probably. Is that guy fucking the truck? Oh, it's a ratata. Hi. It disappeared. What? What do you mean it disappeared? You fucking jump into the water? What are you doing? Screw it, matey. I'm busy. Can't you see? I'm also only I also only speak to people with style, you know. You look like style is not your vocabulary. Neither is your wardrobe. Ah, oh, gee, thanks, man. What happened to the text right there? Can I eat out of the dumpster? No. Who the fuck is he? I'm gonna talk to this guy up here real quick. He looks important. Oh, you. Uh, oh, you were that annoying guy who was screaming, wait, wait. I did a huge favor, you know. I did you a huge favor. Uh, I don't think any other captain would have waited for you to board. I'll ignore the fact that you threw us off schedule. Sorry, Captain, I just... No need to apologize now. Do you know about this port? This port. This port is different. So much has changed. Huh. <sighs> I didn't help you out of kindness. When I was nothing but a decky, the fuck is a decky? Our captain waited for me. He accepted me and gave me a chance to work under him. That desperation and hopelessness. Is that the weight you need to carry? I wonder. I have no idea why you chose to come to this city of all places. Tough. You remind me of myself so much. Listen, kid. I know I've been rumbling like the old man I am, but if there's anything I could advise you, it's to never give up. Ever. A battle is lost only when the will to go on has vanished. The only option is to move forward. Be it a little step, no matter how significant or insignificant. Me? I've found my port. I wish you luck. Okay. Are these the people that we needed to talk to? Is there anything back here? No. Who are you? If I swim, will I escape? Will I finally be free? Can't see anything on the horizon. Wish I had a boat. Or wish you were Michael Phelps. Nope, no entry. Okay, bye. Guess we're not going there. God. Why can't I go to the lighthouse? I wanted to see cool things. I don't know. Alright. Can I steal the truck? Is this GTA? Nope. Can't steal trucks. God damn it. Hello. Selling drugs? Can I have some meth? I expected some kind of generic dialogue. Piss off. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> Sorry. What the fuck are you doing up there? Is, is there something up there? Yeah, there's a nerd up there. Nerd, what are you doing? Can I get up there? Nope. hell are you doing? Ha, 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 arg. Oh, they're, they're so scary. Gonna have to follow orders and assist them. I don't think these guys will need any help, though. Okay. Hello, old man. How's it going? The sea. Great talk. <laughs> Two words. The sea. That's all you need to know. God damn it. Uh, those guys seem important, so I'll wait to talk to them. Huh, I wonder what's for dinner. Oh, my boy. You look tired. You should get some rest. Sleep is extremely important, you know. Though I doubt you'll manage to get any here. Can I not just sleep on the street? Is that not an option? Probably not. The Thirsty Badoof. Oi there, mate. The Thirsty Badoof is the place to relax and share your story. It's the sweetest place in all of Irinia, you hear? Bleh, that bar is up that bar up there. It's disgusting. It stinks so much. No idea why my mates like it. Is it the only bar here? Because that would explain it. Is there somebody back there? Yes, there was. You looking for something? Uh huh. Okay. Looks like something hidden here. Nope. Okay. Just want to look around a bit more. Okay. 
If you're looking for secrets here, you'll be disappointed. The only secret is your unquenchable curiosity, which obviously by now is not a secret anymore. Loser. Damn. How did this game know I liked it? What the fuck? I don't think that's supposed to be possible. I'm going to save my game just in case something like that happens again. Was that supposed to be possible? But damn, how this game know that I like searching for shit? It's like my hobby. I enjoy searching. What's up, nerd? Excuse me, I do not socialize with intellectually inferior beings. Please be gone, you uneducated trash. I only talk to dolphins. <laughs> wow. This place is members only, pal. Say the password and I'll let you in. Uh, <laughs> ravioli? You suck. Is that the password? Damn. What if that was really the password? <laughs> Sesame seeds. Maybe you should consider that. These guys making out? I have no idea what I'm going to do with my wife. Can't believe he's actually brought a bus only to display it here. What? The length this man will go, it's preposterous. The only bus and he wastes it like this. Yeah, we could all be going on a road trip right now. Huh? I suppose you didn't hear my monologue, right? No, I heard it. Are you new here? Stay away from this wretched place. We never talked. Uh, okay. Shit. Hi, Mr. Bus Guy. Haha! -ha. Welcome to our Timisia. Welcome is the most clean, incredible city in the world. It's a hospital, warm, caring, friendly place. Our incredible quality of life and total satisfaction is the result of the work of our extraordinary mayor. He is such a generous person. He is a terrific, majestic, bright, intelligent, compassionate man. The depths of his grace and mercifulness are Im immeasurable. Please enjoy your stay here at the fabled Diamond of the West. You will literally never leave because there's no way out of here. This guy seems soulless. Damn. Oh, ouch. Who the fuck are you? Gah. Gah. When the... F are you blind, you madman? B -f 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 I have to throw this useless trash bag. Hey, I'm talking to you. This horrible city, bleh, full of trash. Wait, what are you? Blarga. Are you crazy? Why did you throw that trash bag at me? Oh, dang it. What is this? Ew. Hmm? What? Is someone insignificant talking to me? Damn. I cannot distinguish between an unimportant person and a pile of trash. I'm about to whoop somebody's ass. Can I whoop somebody's ass, please? This is like the fifth guy that's called me, nah, called me trash or like unimportant or some shit like that. Sorry. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, great. I literally stink now. I mean, it's not like you didn't stink before. You said you didn't take a bath in three days, dude. Shit. Are you stupid or something? Well, it took five days to get it. That means we took a bath on the ship. So why couldn't we take a bath every day? I don't think that logic adds up. Huh? What is this lowly life form talking about? The only lowly thing here is your behavior. Don't you know any manners? 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 Me? Mia, 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 mia. Jesus. You would be a great comedian if you didn't function as a joke yourself. Oh my god, savagery. Ha ha ha. Wow, how many brain cells did you waste on that line? Listen, you little brat. I can see you have no Pokemon with you. Do you even fathom how easy it is for me to send you flying three regions away? Please, get me off this fucking place, dude. This place sucks. I can, and will order Dusknor to punch you into oblivion within minutes. Whatever you say, I don't have time for this. Time, you stupid peasant. That's my line. Now move. He sped on the ground. Man, this place is really weird. What a dick, dude. I didn't know I can go through that. What the fuck? Oh, that's a door. Didn't look like one to me. I'm going back. That did not look like something I could walk through. What, how the fuck to talk to that person up there? Jesus. Okay, well, I guess we'll check out the thirsty Badoo. Uh. What the hell? Uh. Is this the Iggly Buff Cuddle Associate? <laughs> what the fuck? No? It's not? Oh dear me, wrong door. I'll be seeing myself out now if you would excuse me. You! Or who, me? Yes, you. You. Sit. 
Me? Are you sure? Maybe you're referring to this splendid gentleman here. <laughs> Who's a gentleman, you punk-ass brat? Oh my god. Or maybe not. You, come, now. Okay, who the hell's talking to me? Oh, I guess the, the bartender. Morty, special. Mortimer. One special coming right up for our new guest. Oh, yay, I'm a guest. Is that a cello? Can I play it? What? I don't drink. I'm a minor, you know. You know fool, Igor. You know fool, Igor. You look like babyface. What? You know fool, Igor. You look like babyface. <laughs> but you at least 25. This cause you big immature baby. What the hell? Great. Even this bucket head sees right through me. I'm 25 since when? Jesus. I'm 25 and I'm still jobless. Man, my life sucks. Here. Best moo moo milk in universe. <laughs> I'm drinking moo moo milk. Uh, thanks, I guess. Is it poisoned? Well, I'll be. We've got a new member, folks. Well, stranger, Igor liked you, and this is quite the achievement on your side, believe me. So, you're officially a Badoof from now on, but I don't want to be a Badoof. Badoofs are terrible. Splendid. Could I be a Tyranitar or something? What kind of name choice is Badoof anyway? That's what I'm saying. You like Igor. Big baby. Soft heart. Small brain. <laughs> we brothers. <laughs> Small brain. We brothers. Oh my god, I fucking love Igor. Favorite character so far is Igor. Best thing ever. I'm gonna name my firstborn Igor. Oh man, what did I get myself into? By now I assume you do understand that you will take the luxurious place of our new cabin boy. You'll be our swabby, so you gotta run some errands for us. We're family, you know? What? Ah, oh, come on, I didn't sign up for this. Ha ha, you funny. Maybe clean bathroom with Igor? Why do I gotta clean the bathroom with Igor? Why do I feel like that's code for something else that I don't want to be a part of? No, 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 no. I'll do whatever you ask, Morty. Good, good. As you might have heard, we expand our business by delivering some mush. I mean, some milk. Some kush? To extraordinary customers. You look like a bright fella, so I'll be honest with you. It's boring, but it still is work. I'll pay you a couple of bucks for every delivery. Oh, and kid. I can't exactly put my finger on it, but... My gut feeling tells me that you are destined to run a lot during the next days. God damn it. I have two jobs now? Great. I fucking four years, I couldn't get one job, now I got two. Gee, thanks, Mr. Seer. Uh, what else are you foretelling? A uh, new Metroid game or something? Oh my god, I used to love Metroid. What is, uh, Metaroid? Does it help workouts? <laughs> uh, forget about it. Anyways, guys, it's a pleasure and all, but I gotta get going. I need to register for work immediately. Wait, you managed to get employed? Here? Is this in this mess of a city? Huh? Why? Is that, is that bad here? Oh, you're in for a ride, my mate. Oh, come on, it's not that bad, right? I mean, uh, I mean, was employed by the carriers, and they're, they're honorable folks, so... What? Ah, shit. Everyone's looking at me now. What is it now? You don't tell me. You got a job at the carrier center? Or courier center? Guess I was mistaken about you. Igor thinked you, brother. Oh, God, the carry. Guess the carriers are bad people. But you not goody goody. Huh? Guys, is something the matter? Why is being employed by the carriers considered bad? Could you explain it to me? I don't get it. Hey Igor. You think this kid's straight? Or just incredibly dumb? I am apparently just incredibly dumb. Igor think he okay. Huh. Hey, I don't get it. Why are the curry Postmen, old beef with Badoofs. Okay. <laughs> we know likey likey. Uh, okay. <laughs> well spoken, Igor. <laughs> You're such a such a man with words. Very well. We will trust you then. Oh, come on now. Even I am starting to feel bad about this. Aren't the couriers famous for their courage and hard working ethic? 
as well as their rescue operations. Heck, they even replaced the police on certain occasions. Well, yes, they are, they are, kid. Don't pay any attention to us. Anyways, lad, you go do your job, but don't forget to pay our customer a visit. I promise. He lives in southeastern Artemisia. Goes by the name of Cap. Pretty cool guy. Southeastern. So down this way. Got it. You'll know him when you see him. Here's a Moo Moo shake. It's shaken, not stirred. Just as Cap demanded. Oh, the captain. Huh? You haven't got a bag or something? Are you serious? How are you going to carry the Moo Moo shake? I can't believe this kid. Didn't you have anything you needed on you when you came here? Well, uh, no? Okay, I get it. You're poor of the dirt. When you have a bag in your possession, you know where to come. Now off you go. Don't forget to come and visit us after you're finished with your task, okay? Badoofs for life. So did I get the shake or did I not get the shake? Badoofs for life. See ya, kid. Can I talk to Igor one more time? You Badoof now, you family. Fucking love you, Gore. I can walk back here. Cool. Can I play this cello? I'm a mad celloist. Cellist, however the fuck you pronounce it. Did I end up getting a bag from you? Do I have a shake? I think he was talking about the captain guy we were talking to earlier. So I'm gonna go talk to that captain guy and see if we actually got a shake, or if we had to get a bag first, then get the shake. Are you here for business? I doubt it. So scram. I'm guarding the entire operation here. Meddling Bryce like you should learn to stay away. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go talk to the captain just in case. All right, you're not cap, right? Nope. Okay, just in case we have the shake. I don't think we have the shakes. I think he said we need to get a bag before we get the shake, which I don't understand that. Like, why would I carry a shake in my bag instead of just my hand? Okay, I guess we have to get a bag first. And I guess we get a bag by going to the courier station? You know, the place we were originally supposed to go? So, I guess we'll go that way. But before we go that way, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more Spin Connerist. I'll uh, see you guys next time with some more Pokemon postscriptum. Thanks for watching again, and uh, yeah, peace out.